Hey everyone, it's Andrew. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing and testing of the Spring Chef Professional Box Grater in the extra large size. Um, this is a box grater or cheese grater that you can find on Amazon for I think about $16. I got this recently just because I needed another cheese grater and I that was the Amazon's choice online. And so this is the sapphire color. It's like a navy blue color. Um, but this is a very large um, or extra large size box grater for, for grating cheese and vegetables and things like that. And so what we'll do real quick is we'll just show you what it, what it looks like. Um, I'm just gonna take off the labeling. If I can get it off, obviously. I'll just tear it. Um, Um, so, so this is what it looks like. So it's basically a typical box grater in a very large size. This is probably about like three and a half centimeter or inches at the top and probably about four or five at the bottom. On the side here, they do have a plastic coating or plastic label above this side. So I guess you would not cut yourself. Um, so there's a slicer on this side, a medium grater on the one side, and then a smaller grater. So you have the large, small, and then medium, okay? Um, what I'm gonna do is real quick, I'll wash this off, and then I'm gonna test it using some uh, mozzarella cheese, uh, cause I'm gonna be making some pizza today, so give me more. Okay, so now that the cheese grater is uh, kinda all washed, I did wanna make a couple highlights or points that I didn't notice while doing this. So the nice things about this box grater is that it does have a rubber bottom on the bottom, so it prevents it from sliding. Um, it also keeps it kind of flush with the, the cutting board or whatever you're cutting on so that it prevents things from kind of getting all over the place. Um, the top here is not really rubber, it's like a plastic, so it's like a plastic coating on the top, but the rubber's at the bottom. And then there is a kind of nice sturdy handle, so if you're pressing down, you won't slide or anything like that. So, I mean, for a box grater, it's, it seems like it's got everything you need. Really now it's just testing the, the kind of strength or cuttingness of this. Um, so this is just Trader Joe's mo mozzarella cheese. I'm just gonna be making pizza. So we'll just test each side and then we'll grate a bunch of it. So so this is the cutting edge. So, so this clearly works. Um, so as you can tell, it cuts easily, slices straight through it and that's mozzarella cheese. Um, this is gonna be the medium, medium grater. And hopefully I won't cut myself while doing this. But, um, so that's what it looks like as far as the medium grater. It works very effectively, obviously. And then here's the zester or the small grater. Um, this probably won't work. It'll probably just kind of like cram it in because mozzarella cheese is kind of like thick, but um, that's what that looks like. And there is a bunch that came through, but that's that. And then here's the larger one, which is really what I would use for pizza. And so, and so it works, I mean, for what it is. Um, so it's a box grater. You can get it on Amazon for about $16. They have a wide variety of colors. This is the sapphire blue color, but I think they have like 10 other colors and they're all bright. And um, you can vary it based on your personal preference for kind of what your kitchen wants. But this is a $16 cut, uh, box grater. So if you have questions, comments, post them below. But I think this is straightforward. This is really for those of you that are online looking at this grater and trying to figure out whether you want to purchase it. Um, it does what it needs to do. and. It, it's a cheese grater or box grater or whatever you want. So if you have questions, comments, post them below. I'll leave a link in the description for where you can find it. And as always, if uh, you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe if you want to fo follow more of my content.